Omar Khadr, the young Canadian who was captured by U.S. troops in Afghanistan six years ago when he was just 15, is fast becoming one of the most famous detainees at Guantanamo Bay. You know, I'm not a doctor, but I think you're getting good medical care. In Canada Wednesday, his family reacted to this emotional footage of him in 2003, describing his treatment at Guantanamo Bay as he was being interrogated by Canadian officials at the detention facility. What do you want me to? My son is calling for me and I'm sitting here. And I know it is four or five years ago, but he's calling me. His attorneys released the footage, hoping to persuade the Canadian government to seek his return to Canada for trial, rather than going before the U.S. Special Tribunal in Guantanamo later this year. His mother says the last time she saw him was the same July he went missing. Just maybe a week before he went missing, because he was visiting us frequent. Um, one time he just went and he never came back again. Cotter is accused of throwing a grenade in 2002 that killed a U.S. soldier in Afghanistan. His sister had this to say about the emotional footage. I'm not saying my brother is guilty and I'm not saying he's innocent. I'm saying that what's happening is not right even, uh, to an enemy or a friend. It shouldn't be happening. It shouldn't be ha done to anyone. These tapes show a frightened boy. The American military lawyer who is defending Cotter says the Canadian won't get a fair trial at Guantanamo Bay, but Canada's prime minister has dismissed calls that Canada lobby for his return, saying the 21-year-old should stay at the U.S. prison. Carlotta Bradley, The Associated Press.